All right, this feature focus is all about schedule contacts. Now, the reason for schedule contacts in FlipPilot is when you have a new record come into FlipPilot, whether it was a call that came in, a missed call, or something like that, you've got to reach out to that seller. And so let's say we've got our new column here. We've got this one that came in from a call and we're going to try to make contact with them. Say we tried to get a hold of them, but we could not. So we need to schedule the follow up and we don't want to put them on an automated follow up sequence because we really just want to get a hold of them first. So we're going to give some shots at doing that. So inside the record, I can do an add scheduled contact and say whether I want to specify what this contact should be, whether it should be a manual call or whether we should text them or email them. Most of the time I'm doing scheduled contacts for a call to follow up. So try to get a hold of. And then I'm going to set that for today. Uh, just in a couple hours I'm going to try them again. So I'm going to do like 3, 3.30 would be a good time. I'm going to add that scheduled contact. So now I've got a scheduled contact. It's incomplete until I do it later. All right, so that's on this record. Now when I close that, I'll see on the card, it's showing me about this scheduled contact, this next contact here. And so the way I have my pipeline set up, I have a contact made so I know that I addressed this when I try to make contact and I wasn't able to, so now I'm just putting them into contact not made. The cool thing is also that scheduled contacts are a way to follow up. So we do have them on your follow-ups page here and you can see a list of all the scheduled contacts you have to make. Uh, we're going to show you the seven days from today to seven days and anything beyond that is just too much. So we just show you that. And so you can see them all here. You can go down this list and click them off as you do them. And as you can see, we have a lot of other info here as well about that record so that you can view it and just work those scheduled contacts down the list. So it's very cool. It's a great way to work through all your scheduled contact follow-ups that you have to do. And especially just to make sure that no lead is ever left behind, that you don't drop the ball on making contact with these super valuable leads.